Greetings everyone, I'm Dr. Ant. In the Neanderthals Are Us video, see link below, I stated that viewing Neanderthals as stupid and brutish is 100 years out of date. Over the past 30 years, what we've learned about Neanderthals shows that they were very smart and creative. Also, genetic analysis shows that many of us have Neanderthal ancestry. This is especially true if you have red hair and blue or green eyes. Neanderthals created complex stone tools based on a blade technology that they developed before other human groups moved into Europe. Neanderthals hunted big game with massive spears, but they also hunted birds, seals, and dolphins. There is also evidence that they fished. Hunting dolphins would indicate that Neanderthals had some type of watercraft like a canoe. A Neanderthal site in Italy has stone tools that indicate that they were hunting small game, such as birds, with darts or arrows. Neanderthals in Spain were using a variety of plants and mushrooms, not just for food, but for their medicinal properties. The earliest evidence for jewelry comes from a Neanderthal site dating to 130,000 years ago. Polished eagle talons would have been strung on a cord and worn around the neck or wrist. Neanderthals twisted plant fibers to make string and cordage at least 90,000 years ago at a site in France, and based on the talon jewelry, probably over 130,000 years ago. Stones, teeth, and claws have been found with tiny drilled holes. They were probably threaded on the string. Feathers from raptors and corvids were used as adornment possibly in hair or on clothing. The earliest cave art in Europe occurs at Neanderthal sites in Spain. Dated between 66,000 and 41,500 years ago, the art includes drawings of animals, handprints, geometric signs, and engravings. This image shows several handprints. And of course, Neanderthals were the first to bury their dead. This is why we have a number of complete skeletons. Everything that many 20th century paleoanthropologists thought were indications of so-called modern humans that made them a different, smarter species from Neanderthals have actually been found in Neanderthal sites that are much older than the so-called modern sites. Neanderthals were not a different species of human. They were just a different population of humans, much as French and Chinese are different populations of humans. What happened to Neanderthals? Nothing happened to them. They mated with other human groups. Over time, some of their distinctive features became less common, such as red hair and green eyes. But other features are still present, such as their creativity and intelligence. If you have Eurasian ancestry, you should be proud that you also have Neanderthal ancestry. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel.